Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I've got two altar boxes to open up. And um, I don't know why they split these up into two. Because one feels pretty light, the other one is really heavy. So I think the, they both belong to the same orders. But when I open it up, I'm going to see what's going on here. So I just stopped my camera so I can uh, go ahead and open both boxes. So I've got two packing slips here and it's all belonging to one order. I don't know why they split it up. I mean, they ended up coming on the same, around the same time. Okay, we'll start with the heavier box first. And I got this. Milani Gilded Desires uh, palette, which I saw this and I actually I wasn't looking for this palette. It came up as a suggestion because I was looking at other palettes at the time and this came up as, as a recommendation. So I saw that the colors, they look pretty nice. So I decided to get it. I'm just going to try and open this up and see if I can show you guys what it looks like. So it's wrapped in this uh, foamy thing which is really nice and the palette is attractive like the packaging is really nice. And on the back they give you the names of the shades. Okay and this is what the colors look like so I think you've got highlighters in there as well as eyeshadow palettes. Um, so I'm, I'm liking this palette because it looks attractive and I've been reading the reviews on it and there's been a lot of good reviews and that's how I like to shop. I like to read reviews um, bearing in mind that sometimes things look different on people because Everybody's skin is not the same, but it's always good to try new products, but this had a lot of positive reviews So that's one of the reasons why I grabbed this and I always like Milani's uh, Packaging even for their lipsticks as well as well as blushes I have a few of their lipsticks and I love them. They smell really good, too so I decided to grab this and I've been seeing a couple other videos with some newer palettes that are out that I haven't seen in Ulta as yet. So I'm going to be looking for those ones as well because they seem to be pretty nice colors. So that is the palette. Actually, I've been holding on to these boxes a while because I just wasn't finding the time to do the unboxing. I, I wanted to sit in front of the camera to do this, but... I was so busy that I couldn't get it done and also um, I do have another large order that I place from Ulta because I love Ulta so much I'm actually obsessed with that company because they sell Sephora products as well as drugstore products I mean you can't beat that and some of the prices are like a really good you know what I mean so I like that they have a variety as well as prices that are affordable so you don't always have to buy the expensive stuff you can always go to you know the drugstore prices and and sometimes you get free gift with purchase it depends on what they have or if something is on sale you can get it on a sale too so that's a plus as well so i'm looking at my slip here what i showed you was the milani face and eye palette and gilded desires and I think I got this one free at the time this was um, a makeup pouch when you spend a certain amount or you buy L'Oreal I, I, I think I, it's been such a long time so it's just a, a nice little pale pink uh, um, makeup purse that you can use so that's the inside i think this was a gift with purchase so when you oh yeah i, I now i remember i've had this thing so long that i tend to forget so you got the 
the purse and then you can choose a lipstick as well which I ended up choosing one that I didn't really want but it was the only one available so it was this one right here I think I don't know if I really care for this shade but let me just show you guys it's really a dark shade which I'm not used to wearing and I don't really know if this will look good on me so it's kind of too dark it's darker than what I usually wear but we'll see maybe I'll just give it to somebody or try and sell it we'll see but I mean it's nice that I actually got something free which you know not every time that you shop online you get free stuff so that was like a plus for me okay and in this little baggie here that i took that lipstick out i've got a um what is this called a mario badescu uh skincare facial spray with aloe cucumber and green tea it's a spray So this is in 59 ml, which is kind of an odd figure, 2 ounces, because usually it's 30 ml or 50 ml or 100 ml. So let's see what this was. So it says here, invigorate dull tired skin with an infusion of botanical extracts and cucumber and peppermint essential waters. This facial mist delivers a cooling boost of hydration that leaves skin feeling refreshed and revitalized. Mist before moisturizer for added hydration throughout the day to revive and refresh skin or after makeup application to give skin a dewy finish. Use as needed. So maybe it's like a, I don't know if it's quite a setting spray, but more like a, a refreshing kind of spray so this might be kind of good in the summertime which in we're not having summer here anymore at the moment so but you can still i can still try it out and see what effect it got it gets so um this here i think this is the smaller size there is a bigger size as well so that was the travel size facial spray and now I'm going to show you the Neutrogena sunscreen which has 85 plus broad spectrum SPF. So that is the reason why I chose this one because we get really hot summers here and I wanted something that really can protect my skin. I can use it on my face and stuff like that especially as we go out on the boat sometimes we can be out there for hours in the sun so i mean it will be good for that also if i'm working in the yard because in the summertime i tend to pull weeds and stuff like that so you know you're getting hot out there you want to have something that's going to protect your skin and um lightweight clean feel fast absorbing water resistant for 80 minutes so with all sunscreens i think you have to reapply after an hour i could be wrong um but i just saw 85 and i've never really noticed 85 before i think i've seen 60 and i do believe there is a hundred spf too uh, in the same brand but i i don't think i i they had that one anymore i saw it advertising on tv and that is why i decided to buy it and then after i bought this one i noticed that they had the 100 spf as well so i said well maybe next time it's not really a big um a big size but i mean sometimes you don't need to use too much and we have other sunscreens but i usually put it on under my makeup as well because you know just because it might look like it's not sunny doesn't mean that the rays are not coming through so you always have to use sunscreen even in the winter time and it they do expire so you have to keep a note of the date on the back there it's on the top very small i'm gonna have to check that out after 
Okay, and now I'm seeing a palette, so I'm getting excited. Oh, this is so cute. Look at this. Makeup Revolution. I am so in love with Makeup Revolution. I love the brand. I didn't know this brand existed until I was watching a YouTuber that lives in the UK and she buys a lot of their their uh, products. They also make like gift sets at Christmas time. Her husband would buy them for her and stuff. That is how I discovered it. And then I saw that nobody in Canada sells it. And then I was super excited when I realized that um, Alta was selling it. Also Aurabel that I did that video recently, they do carry it now, but it just takes a while for them to get the newer stock in. So that's pretty good. And this was sold out at the time. So it's actually a highlighter palette. And I was waiting for it to come back in stock so I can pick it up. Okay, so this is what the colors look like up close. And I just think this is a beautiful looking palette. Oh, I just love it. I'm going to swatch some colors and see what they look like. So that was this color I swatch right here. This one on the top right here. That's this one here. So I love this palette and there's other Makeup Revolution things that are coming. I've seen on the Makeup Revolution website but they haven't come to Ulta as yet. And I can't order from that website because um, I don't know what the duties are going to be when they get here because they're not charging duties at checkout and for that I wouldn't order because I don't want it to get here and then realize that I'm being charged too much for duties. So I'm going to wait till whenever Ulta gets them in I will pick them up if I can. But really nice packaging, very attractive and... I was so disappointed when this got sold out because I wanted it so bad and I saw it in another YouTuber's video as well. She usually buys a lot of high-end high makeup as well as drugstore type ones and she does reviews on them and I so badly wanted this one. So that was the, um, where is it, the Soap X Highlighter Palette. And what have you got here? Okay, this is the the Paradise Enchanted Fruit Scented Paradise Enchanted Scented Eyeshadow Palette by uh, L'Oreal. So that's probably why I got this purse free. When you spend a certain amount on the L'Oreal stuff. You got the purse free. I think that's what this was. So look at this. This is super cute. This was sold out as well. And I've been wanting this one so badly. Alright. So this is what this looks like. I mean this is gorgeous. Look at those colors. I just love L'Oreal. Their packaging is so attractive. And for a drugstore brand. You know what I mean. It's so attractive. I love it. Nice colors that will go look good on my skin tone which is what I'm really looking for now I, I stop buying palettes just because they look attractive I buy the ones that I know will look good on me so that is so cute I love that and then they they give you tips on how to use them and stuff like that that is so nice give you a guide for people like me who are not uh, professionals at applying makeup or eyeshadows this would work well for me so that was the paradise enchanted scented eyeshadow palette let me see if i can smell it oh it does smell like a peach wow that is so nice it's scented this enchanted fruit scented blush by l'oreal again I love L'Oreal and that's what this looks like so in my first haul I got one of these but 
I wanted this color and it was sold out. So as soon as it came back, I just grabbed it because I knew I was going to be placing another order and it was back in stock. So I just grabbed what I could before it's gone again. So um, this one, let's see if they give me the name of the color. Uh, this one is called Bashful. So 190 Bashful. So I had a hard time getting it open because I couldn't tell where the lines were for the tape. I ended up peeling off a part of the back there, but that's fine. I mean, I like it. So, but it's so hard when they um, seal these things like that. It's barely showing on me. Pretty light. I might use it as a powder. Oh yeah, you can see it right there. It's nice color. Very light and mild. I guess I can use it like maybe a bronzer too. I mean, like look at these packaging. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. I've been accumulating a bunch of nice palettes and I'm so happy because all the colors are looking good on me. So I'm really happy about that. Okay, so that was that first box. Now I'm gonna open this other box and this one has just one item in there and it is um, Pacifica Underarm Wipes. So that's these things. I can't believe they just put one item in here with a bunch of bubble tape or bubble wraps or whatever you call these things. So this is what these look like. Um, let's see if I can get a better focus here for you. Odor neutralizing with coconut milk and essential oils. All skin types. 10 pre-moistened towelettes. Okay, what does it say here? 100% vegan, cruelty-free, underarm wipes. With coconut milk, effective odor control, aluminum-free, helps stop the mal malodors <laughs> under your arms and wipe away excess perspiration. This is an everyday solution to deodorizing while leaving a subtle scent that blends well with everything else you layer on. Smell pretty without harsh chemicals or innovative formula utilizes odor neutralizing natural ingredients for helpful odor control and protection. Use as a deodorant under your arms in the morning. Take with you for times when showering is not an option after yoga on camping trips or times of high stress for reapplication, not an antiperspirant. So, and then it says on the bottom here, every true beauty knows it's what's on the inside that matters, formulated with women, animals, and the planet in mind. So that's pretty good, it's natural. So I just thought that I could keep this in my purse, you know, like they said for maybe if you went to the gym and you're on your way home, you just want to freshen up a little bit. You didn't get to use the showers at the gym for whatever reason, or maybe you're out jogging or whatever. You can always keep, keep it with you if you have a purse that is. Or just going somewhere and oh, sometimes maybe you go out, you forget to put deodorant on or something and you just want to uh, freshen up. Also, it's good to use in the summertime when you sweat a lot. So I'm going to keep this in my purse. Uh, first, I'm going to try it out and see if I like it. And then I can order some more because I think they come in different scents as well. I just didn't want to have anything overpowering because when I buy deodorants, I never pick ones that are highly scented. I prefer non-scented ones. I don't want it to be too obvious. I mean, if I'm going to 
wear a perfume, then that's different. That's going to smell nice, but not my deodorant. That's just not right for me. Okay, guys. Well, that was my Ulta, my second Ulta unboxing. And I got to say, I'm pretty impressed. Nothing came leaking out this time so that's pretty good it means i'm going to be ordering from them again and um i'm so looking forward to buying more from them their stuff is just great i love it and i can't wait to play around with these things they're so gorgeous and my nice milani palette this one was pricey but you know what? It's going to be worth it. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And let me know if you like anything you saw in the video. As soon as Canada's post strike is over, there will be more purchases, more stuff coming. Well, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you again in my next video. Bye, guys.